He adds so much personality to this house. It's, I don't know what we would do without him. Just such a big, bright energy. You know, like I said in his bio, he has a big heart and an ego to match. He's a funny guy, you know, just to make people laugh and just change their energy. Yeah. Uh, so, you know, that's kind of his job is to be the comedian. Yeah. And I think he, he sure does is. that quite well. <laughs> <laughs> yes, he does. So I know I was not sure whether to ask that question or not about the humping, but it has been an ongoing issue since he was a young puppy and it never seems to let up at all. Um, we've asked other people about it. They, you know, Truman kind of has the attitude like, that's just what guys do. So I'm going to do it when I get the urge. Um, but it is a little embarrassing going to dog parks and he just won't, when he finds one he loves, he just will not <laughs> let up. <laughs> I mean, there doesn't even have to be a dog there sometimes. He's just, when he's in the mood, he'll just be air humping or, yeah. So let's have a look at that because this is this is not kind of where I thought it was going to go. When I first asked him about this, I just get, you know, it's almost like a, a Tom Cruise look where the, the sunglasses come down to the nose and he looks up, it's like eye rolling. That's my that's my thing, man. You know, that's mm -hmm. what I do. Yeah. I'm a man, I'm a dog and, and I'm pretty cool. Uh, so there is definitely that element of being a cool dude and it's a manly thing to do. But what I see it is as an energy block. Now, if you can imagine a scratch that you can't itch, mm -hmm. that, the, that the itch is really deep and you scratch the surface of your skin but the itch is deeper than that and you're scratching and it's just like you're just not quite getting it. Or there's another sensation for some of you that, that may uh, have experienced this where you need to urinate and you've finished but there feels like there's more there but there's no more there. There's a lot of energy down in that um, that base chakra, second chakra end, the tail and the legs and the pelvis and all, all in there that is just blocked, humping to have an end result or an outcome. There's no mm -hmm. outcome. So you can kind of imagine just in a feeling how that would be for him. Yeah, sure. So you've got to keep trying, don't you? So you don't, you hump and nothing happens. You don't get that that final feeling of release and so you go again. From his point of view, it's actually kind of frustrating. I'm sure. Uh, from yours, it's embarrassing. From his, it's just like, oh, I just, I want to I want to get it. I want to, I want that energy to keep flowing through me. So I just want to see whether something like an energy healing or I'm getting shown hydrotherapy. It's this movement thing. It's like you keep moving the front and the back legs and the energy keeps moving through the body. Energy healing for animals. Um, it's that idea of pulling energy through, Okay. pulling it all the way through. He would like a solution to that, actually. And so he okay. has his really fun, funny part. He's got the star Truman and then he's got his kind of serious side. So he would actually like some kind of resolution to 